I brought a composition that was written by my father back in seventh grade in Sunbury High School in 1923. It was a uh, school assignment and um, he wrote about the history of Sunbury and included some uh, postcard pictures from that date. One of the pictures is of the uh, Fort Augusta historical site, uh, their front entrance, which is now different. This picture would predate the 1936 flood. The other thing I brought is my father's uh, high school yearbook from 1929 when he was a senior. And it's, uh, I think, a little bit different than what they do now as far as presentation. I mean, the, the subjects are the same, but they just have them arranged a little bit different for the pictures, and, and they go into the sports, and the picture of the old high school, which is where this library is now. Again, it's history. It can be interesting, the, uh, the way they did the pages up. Uh, they put some work into it. Uh, I know they do that today, too, but I don't think they do it quite this way. So it's, it's, you know, something I'm sure people would be interested in. I mean, history should be shared, and you can learn from history. Um, I've seen history change. I'm 72 years old, so I've been around a little bit. And uh, I have seen this town changed. Uh, I can remember when people would gather in the street corners, which they don't do now. Uh, and if they do, you wonder what they're up to. But uh, I just, uh, Sunburyan by birth. I lived in New Jersey for about 23 years. Uh, my father worked for Westinghouse, and when they moved down there, of course, I was too young to say I don't want to go. And, but I came back in 76, and... Uh, I thoroughly enjoy it up here. You can get out of town. Down in New Jersey, you can't get out of town, you land in the next one. <laughs>